Have you heard about Europe's planned drone war? It's something European leaders are backing, but what exactly is a drone war? Effectively, we're talking about putting up a giant shield to protect European continents against drone incursions. It follows two incidents, one in Poland where Russian drones were shut down having entered its airspace, the other in Denmark when unidentified drones forced the closure of two airports. Russia denies any involvement. Officials and analysts say such incidents have exposed gaps in Europe's ability to defend itself against drones. So how do you make a drone war? French President Emmanuel Macron says for starters we need advanced early warning systems to better anticipate threats. This could include the use of the AWACS, such as the E-3A Airborne Warning and Control System aircraft. It's already NATO's eye in the sky and can provide surveillance or detection of targets, including low-flying drones that ground-based systems might miss. UK Typhoon and Voyager tankers are already on hand in Poland, protecting the eastern flank. They were deployed after Russian drones first entered Polish airspace. But what about air defence systems available? One example is the draft radar that is part of the Royal Artillery Sky Saber system. It's a lightweight, multi-mission, 3D surveillance radar for air and surface surveillance, known for its capable drone detection. And what about air defence missiles? The UK Sky Sabre can control 24 surface-to-air missiles simultaneously whilst in flight and guide them to intercept 24 separate targets. NATO forces will probably line borders with weaponry to act as a deterrence. One on the cards could be Germany's Gepard, an anti-aircraft gun tank nicknamed the Cheetah. It's armed with two 35mm machine guns and it's capable of engaging with aerial targets at 5,000 metres and at a height of 3,500 metres. Then there's electronic warfare jamming systems blocking the drone from the airspace as well as microwaves. The US and UK are using kit to take down a swarm of drones. British soldiers have used the radio frequency directed energy weapon, which is said to be cheaper than the cost of a pack of mince pies at just 10p a shot but they're only capable of hitting targets up to one kilometre away. There's plenty that could be added to this wishlist. What would you add to the drone wall? Let us know in the comments.